Collective, this is Nick. I hope that everybody is doing well. I came to bring you guys your energy. As I meditated over this energy, Collective, and Collective is for all 12 signs, including the signs that I do, okay? So you might find yourself here. Puzzle pieces, every time you guys get a general read from me, it is always puzzle pieces, okay? Um, but what I picked up was there's no reciprocation from somebody here. Somebody is definitely losing interest and they're not taking accountability. They're pushing somebody away here, okay? Um, yeah. And not giving anybody any answers, okay? Being pretty much being left off to their self, all right? In their own thoughts. Well, the reason why this is collective is because somebody has definitely, either somebody has legal problems, okay? It could be that, okay? Judgment is here. So that is court of law, okay? Or what it is, is they've made up their decision. The decision to go out and to um, be flirtatious. There is somebody in somebody's energy here that is very sexy, crazy, cool. Um, I don't know who this is. You're going to have to find yourself in this. Uh, I'm going to do my level best to try to help you find yourself. Um, but nonetheless, um, it, this energy of somebody, you know, indulging in somebody who is very sexy, crazy, cool um, could possibly have a hot temper. Um, this person could have gotten to it with them before. This person is a little bit bossy to a certain degree, but this person likes it like that. Okay. Um, this in this, this falling back without somebody knowing it, um, has caused them to be blinded by the truth. One word, all words, no words, you guys. Blinded by the truth, self-imposed prison, anxiety, fear, helplessness, feeling trapped, powerless, victimization, victimized, and restrictions. Somebody loves this buck wild ass individual, okay? Um, I do not know if they thought that this person was a buck wild individual to begin with because it does not seem like this person showed an awful, awful, awful lot of interest in the beginning. They may or were superficial. They, you guys may have talked about certain things that maybe somebody who is really trying to get a relationship off the ground talks about. But as far as the come through factor, it, it is not, okay? Because what this person is known to do is this person is known to fall back, okay? This person is known to pull their energy back um, as soon as they get close, all right, to somebody. They're very spontaneous, you guys. Um, this person with just me saying what I want to say, this person could be a fire sign. This person could be a water sign. This person can be your air sign and it could be our sign. You guys, you know, this might resonate for a whole lot of people. Okay. Cause everybody's here. Nonetheless, this person here, um, loves to fall back. They love to recuperate once they get put into the relationship or put into like maybe a, um, you know, a, 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 a situation to where they're willing to go forth. Okay. They may talk about it, but as soon as they talk about it, they pull it back. You see what I'm saying? And they're and the reason why is because they're all over the place. They're a spontaneous energy. They're in full energy all of the time. They're looking for new excitement. They're full of original originality. They're willing to take lit Reese Rick's, leaps of faith and also risk okay not only risking their own safety and heart but also risking the person who they're dealing with at that particular time this this reading makes me feel like papa was a rolling stone it doesn't really feel like this person really settles down for real with anybody and if they do settle down um to a certain degree it's temporary okay ghosting comes to my mind even though I don't have the eight of cups, I do got the four of cups. Okay. So the four of cups is really, I don't give a damn. Okay. This is instant gratification for me. I'm having fun. And anytime it gets a little bit too serious, then I'm in a four of cups. That means I don't want it anymore. Okay. So therefore when I get to the four of cups and I don't want it anymore, I go to falling back. And when I fall back, I go meet other people and I go enjoy other people. Okay. This is spontaneous energy. Somebody definitely is hurt behind this. Somebody definitely spent time in hermit mode. Somebody definitely fit, fit, sit, top, spent time on ascension, self-searching, self-reflection, introspection, wisdom, solitude, self-care, self and inner guidance, and also analyzing this situation to the nth degree, okay? Um, hermit mode, you guys, is somebody who really is, is plagued with thoughts. They're trying to analyze. They're trying to figure things out. Why did this person just abandon? in me why is it that one minute it seems like everything was going straight and then all of a sudden they flip mode 
um, on me, okay? And the reason why, like I said, is because when they get close to people, all right, they get to the point to where they push them away, all right? They become in a four of cups. That means I don't want you no more, okay? And what they do is they essentially fall back from the relationship, even though you may talk to them, okay? But they're not talking the same way that they used to talk. Reason being is because they've already made their mind up. What they made their mind up to do is to go deal with other people, okay? And then the, re the cycle repeats itself, even with the new person, okay? This person is constantly planning, all right? This person may be a little bit younger than somebody or somebody may be younger than somebody here. What they're planning on doing is being in a single and abundant, y'all, okay? Marriage is not on the table with this individual, okay? They're willing to be single and abundant. What they want is, is they want a business. They want to be grounded, mm -hmm. Love you too. They want gener they want to be um they want generosity and they want luxury, okay? They want successfulness. They're down to earth and they're practical, okay? They can be a very much so social butterfly. And I really think that's an understatement of the word because I really believe that this person is too damn friendly, okay? Towards everybody. The reason why, you guys, is because this is a night of wands that we're dealing with, okay? This is a buck wild hope that we're dealing with, okay? This is somebody who is in and out. This is inconsistency. This is saying what you want to hear. This is somebody going to the beat of their own drum and they do not really care about other people's feelings. The only feelings that they care about is their damn self, okay? Um, this is a person who, um, you know, is like I said, they're very selfish, all right? And they're very promiscuous as well, okay? They like sex, all right? So this is what I have for you and this is what we're going to deal with. This is very sad to me. <laughs> not just for you if you're the one that's going through this this is also sad for me for this person and the reason why is because it's not that they haven't had people in the past that are willing to love them it's not that they haven't had people in the past that are willing to have some type of stability and to have their back they choose not to now maybe it's because they've been hurt before a lot of times people when they're hurt before they just don't have it in them to be able to be as vulnerable as maybe they were before um they got hurt by you know whoever they got hurt by you see what i'm saying so they've become bitter and they've become selfish okay but in that bitterness and in that selfish collective they are pretty much cheating themselves okay rather this is a male or rather this is a female okay because there are certain people like i just said that really would like to have something with this person and i'm not talking about bullshit people i'm not talking about ratchets i'm talking about people of stature people who um you know i'm not going to say you know is filthy millionaire status rich but at the same time, got their head on their shoulders, okay? Know how to go get it. Want it, go get it, and also wants to have this person back. But as soon as somebody gets close to this person, this person, you know, they, they fall back and they just don't want it anymore. They like to play. This is a player, okay? Rather it's a female player or rather this is a dude player, okay? It doesn't make a difference. It's a player, all right? And that's exactly what they do. They play. And the only thing that they're interested at this point in the game is they're interested in their bag, all right? They're interested in being single, and they're interested in being abundant, all right? They like that life, okay? So, you know, this is what we're dealing with, and it's fucked up, you know what I'm saying? Especially, I know this right here hurts because I got somebody sitting over here that's full of anxiety. They're in a self-imposed prison. They're blinded by the truth. They don't understand why this person switched up on there. They feel very, very helpless because this person is not giving answers. This person is not taking accountability. This person is lying, okay? And the only reason why they're lying is, number one, they may not want to hurt your feelings, okay? And number two, they may want to disguise who they really are, which is this buck wild ass not a not a wands okay somebody feels helpless somebody feels powerless somebody feels victimized okay so i don't like this energy for you guys okay now you may be the perpetrator and i'm sure if you're the perpetrator you have all your reasons in the world on why you do this on why you push people away okay and my, me myself what i'm feeling is is because you've been hurt okay you've been hurt in a major way and because you've been hurt in a major way, you're scared to death to open up and to be vulnerable with somebody who really truly deserves for you to be vulnerable. 
if this is you, okay, and you're showing up as this buck wild hole, um, not a wands that's out here, um, you know, playing, playing, play on player, that type of stuff, and about the bag, you're missing out, okay? And the reason why you're missing out is because when you are this type of individual, okay, who only cares about playing the field and only cares about, you know, um, dealing with this person and that person, then you never get any real intimacy, okay? You never get a real chance to, to for someone to show you that not only they love you but you're worth being loved okay and that right there is a commodity that is very rare in this world okay this person has ran across several of them all right and the only thing that they've done is they've left a trail of break broken hearts okay you're not the only one. If this is you, you're not the only one that feels blinded by the truth. You're not the only one that feels anxiety and fear and helplessness and feeling trapped and, and helpless and victimized, not understanding and not getting answers. You're not the only one. Other people have felt the same thing. There is somebody in their sights right now, okay? This person could be a Leo, a Sagittarius, Aries. This is a very fun person. This person can be um, a Sagittarius. Um, it can be um, a Virgo towards Capricorn and possibly Air, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. Um, um, collective, I love you guys dearly. Thank you so much for joining the channel. Thank you so much for your likes, your shares, and your subscriptions. If you guys are new here, please go at the description box, excuse me, the comment box below. Let me know that you are new so I can give you a warm welcome to the channel that I love to do, okay, and that you deserve. Also, if you guys have not subscribed to the channel, please accept my invitation to subscribe. There are a lot of things that are going on on this channel. For every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. Um, my mystery grabs are very fun. They're very random. Set your notification bell because sometimes I wake up at 4 o'clock in the morning and I give five people probably 30 minutes to be able to contact my email, okay? And that also consists of reads and items. They're very fun, you guys. Also, my monthly giveaways, you guys. My monthly giveaways consist of items and reads as well. There are so many ways to get reads on this channel, okay? Um, you guys, if you go in the description box, if you're interested in any of my plans, um, my personal reads and also my VIP plans, um, my VIP plans I am pushing because you get more for your money. You get one read plus a uh, energy check once a week in a 30 uh, um, 30 day period of time and I like recurring so if you come back I'm going to give you an extra discount everything for my verified subscribers is discounted inside of that um and description box except my reads okay if you just want one personal read that is not discounted okay but my other ones are all right um and also you guys i am trying to get to 10k so i am going to be giving away i'm not saying that i'm giving this to the 10,000th winner but once i hit 10k there will be somebody um that is chosen i'm going to be going on who is my most top content um um, commenter okay so I will be looking at those whoever comments the most will be receiving this after I get 10,000 it does come with the box and also the social security the, the social security number y'all the serial number okay so this right here is a purse charm okay I use these I put these on my purses I do not have a puppy this is the only puppy that I have um, and also it is monogram by Louis Vuitton it has a um, little pouch in the top where you can put your credit cards, lipsticks, um, you know, extra cash or whatever. Okay. If you are a dude and you are chosen, you guys can give that to your mom, your sister, or your uh, wife. Okay. Girlfriend or whatever. Okay. So with that being said, you guys, I have already prayed over these uh, clarifiers in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. You guys, I have asked for truth, revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace, and protection. So that is what we are expecting in this read. We are expecting truth, we're expecting confirmation, and we are expecting consolation, okay? And also, I am also extending peace to all of you guys, okay? So with that being said, let's go ahead and get this read. Let me get my um, Holy Spirit. I need you to move, please. Let me get my, um, let me feel this energy so I can get it right. We're not going to take those. I hope you guys are having a great morning collective. All right, you guys. So what is this? Somebody, like I said, somebody possibly could be having legal problems or they just call the shot. Okay. Call the shots and fall back and just don't give a fuck no more. Give me, um, thank you. Yeah. See, they call the shot world here. Something's coming to completion. Something's starting. Something's ending. What's ending is 
whoever is involved in this person's relationship, what's beginning is this person right here, okay, who they got their eyes set on, okay? Give me this uh, Queen of Wands. Or you could be King of Wands, vice versa, you guys. Anytime you guys get a general read from me, it always puts some pieces. Take what fits, leave what don't. And there is no need to comment to let me know that, you know, this, you know, some of it is right. So just, you know, take what fits, y'all. Um, however, you know, like I said, this is a very spontaneous. We got, we got, we got the fool here a couple times. Okay. This is spontaneous energy towards this person. This is, I'm going after it without thinking about it. Okay. I'm going to have some fun with this person, with this crazy, sexy, cool person. And guess what? When I'm tired, I'm going to move on. I will be back in my four of cups and I will be back in my four of um, swords. This is this person. Okay. Give me more. Right, and, and sex, okay? They want sex with this person. They want sex with everybody. I told you it was a buck wild hoe. I did tell you that, right? Okay, so eight, eight of swords, because somebody is hurting behind this. Seriously hurting. They're like, I thought we had something. I thought that this person was the one, okay? Yeah, see? They thought they was loved by this person. They thought that it was gonna be a future with this person. This person showed up is not only just charming y'all, but also giving dreams like, you know, not necessarily maybe I want to do this or maybe it's more like I want to do this in the future. But nonetheless, this person felt love and now they're back into this, this same ass energy. So it's love, then it's blinded to the truth. Then it's anxiety. It's love, then it's self-imposed prison. It's love and then helplessness. Loved, fear. Loved and then feeling trapped. Loved and then feeling powerless. Loved and feeling by, that vic victimized. Loved and feeling restrictions. And love to where somebody can't make sense of what happened. Somebody left somebody hanging here. Somebody left somebody for dead. Give me um, the four of swords because this is what they did. very optimistic in themselves they're very self-absorbed they need a lot of healing you guys this is not something that they they need to go speak to somebody okay i believe they were really hurt and they have not healed okay right and they have a very difficult decision to make when it comes down to when i'm ready to pull my energy back see they don't just pull their energy back they think about it first, okay? So if you got that close to this person, this person reels the energy back in. They thought about this, okay? Give me the fool because this is what they are. They're in the full energy. They stay in the full energy. I mean, you know, it's all about instant gratification. It's all about what make them feel good and how they want to feel good when they want to feel good and with whoever the hell they want to feel good with. Right, see? and lie on top of everything else, okay? So when they get into this spontaneous energy and they go after what makes them feel good, who makes them feel good, guess what? They're gonna lie about this, okay? Oh, I didn't call you because my phone dead, okay? Oh, I didn't call you because my phone is left in the car, okay? Oh, my was in, um, I was in my home girl car and my phone is in there. Oh, I didn't realize that my phone was off. Oh, my phone was dead. You know, that old bullshit, okay? Somebody thought about this. Somebody is really hurting about this. This is literally push somebody yeah, because they're fixed because they love this person who was fucked up to them. Okay. Listen, they're in a five of coins. All right. Not only are they having problems at work, not only are they having life problems, um, not only have this affected their self esteem and their self worth. Okay. They have been blindsided. Um, they're experiencing misfortune of some type of, uh, you know, some type of way they're experiencing six, they're experiencing loss, of course. Okay. Their money may be fucked up. This person may have tried to get up in somebody's money and they possibly might have an STD or they may be sick. Okay. To a certain degree. Give me, give me more of this. They're starting to realize that this person was flirting with them. And it was very superficial. Like I said, somebody's a little bit younger than somebody here, okay? You may hear baby, baby, please, I'm sorry. But the only reason why you may hear baby, baby, please, I'm sorry, collective, is because they want some more sex, okay? They will be ghosting again soon. Give me the four cups, please. They're a liar. It's just that simple. And they need some therapy, all right? 
This person may not be, this person goes off, okay? They, when, when they don't want you no more, they get missing in action. They may travel, they may relocate. Travel relocation is maybe a part of their job. Um, but, you know, it's almost like a feeling of I get close to you, and when I get close to you, it becomes a burden. So what I want is peace after the storm. I, this person is saying, I don't want you asking me questions. I don't want to be accountable to this. I just want to live my life, okay? I want to go and come as I please. I don't want to answer to anybody. I'm not accepting any advice from anybody. When I'm with you, I'm with you. And when I'm not with you, I'm not with you, okay? And when I'm not with you, I don't expect to hear your mouth. I don't expect to hear, where are you, okay? Why haven't you called me? This person is in that type of energy, okay? And like I said, tra travel relocation is here. This person may not be from where somebody is originally from or originally at right now. They may have to travel back and forth for a job or their baby mama, baby daddy, okay? Listen, this person is constantly having people in competition. And the reason why is because they're not loyal, y'all. This loyalty is their theme, okay? People are fighting behind this shit. And then who it feels like people are fighting with is it feels like people are fighting with them, okay? Somebody is calling them on the phone and cussing them out, okay? Um, or if, they, if that person is in somebody's face, they're cussing them out because of how they did this shit. You know, this is some low down shit, okay? And if this is you that did it, it's still low down. You know what I mean? I don't have favorites, okay? It is what it is. Um, but, you know, yeah, they're rapid fire planning and they're really balancing out the situation of what, how, for, how do they want to go? What, what, what direction do they want to go in right now, okay? Or go in in the future. This person is about the money. They want to be single and abundant, okay? They're not really interested in marriage, okay? Period, all right? And it's just not. They got ultimate clarity that they want to be nine of pentacles. Ultimate clarity that they want to be single and abundant, okay? They want their own business. They want to be looked at as the person. They want to be looked at as that girl or that guy, okay? That everybody seems to look up to them, but they're superficial as hell, all right? Right, and they're driven to succeed. It's just that simple. They're driven to succeed, to put on this facade, to put on this image. You see what I'm saying? You see the chick with the glasses and the furs and the money and shit? Yeah, that's, they got ultimate clarity if that's how they want to be seen in the world, okay? They don't want another person standing next to them. And if they do have another person standing next to them, this could be very temporarily and it's only for trophy purposes, okay? It's not because I need for you to outshine me. It's because I need for you to look good standing next to me, okay? That's what that is. They got ultimate ass clarity on this, okay? And they're very much so driven to see, to have their life their way, to do it their way. They're driven to see, to do that. They want victory. They want victory in their damn self, okay? Right, see, six of wands. Victory in their damn self, okay? Not in nobody else. Okay, let's let, let's see what's up with this nine of wands. Holy Spirit, tell me about this buck wild um, individual who played all these games with people. And that five of um, wands could be somebody seeing about their ass too because you don't play with people's heart like this. See? Y'all hit the thumbs up, but thumbs up button for me, please. I would appreciate you before I ask. Listen, the buck wild individual falls back. This is what they do, okay? This is their MO. This is their mo motive of operation. This is what they do. They get close and then they fall back with the four swords, okay? That's what they do. They have sex with people. They lead people on. They, they're very fun to be with now, I will say that, okay? But at the same time, you know, yeah, see? They manipulate, okay? They draw somebody a picture, okay? They draw somebody a picture of what could be, all right? Not necessarily putting their self in it. They may even say something and change their mind, you know, like, oh, one day I want to get married, and then all of a sudden, you know, a couple days later, I ain't never told you that. I don't think I'm going to get married, you know what I'm saying? That type of shit. Yeah, because this person is wounded, set back, guarded. I told you they were hurt, okay? This person was hurt very, very bad. And because this person was hurt very, very bad, <laughs> instead of becoming a better person, they became worse than the person that hurt them, all right? And that's why I say it's sad for both. See? Here you go. Constantly third-party situations. This is what gets them off. It's just that simple. Dealing with several different people. Dealing with several different people and committed to none. Dealing with several different people and committed to none. They do like this Queen of Wands, though. This is in their energy right now. Leo Sagittarius Aries is definitely in their energy right now. They do like this person. But this person about to get cut the fuck off, too, okay? It's just a matter of time. Right. See, didn't I tell you that? Will be an ex-situation. Six of Cups, okay? 
Yeah, your girl tapped in, okay? This is a really fucked up individual. Now, if you are the if fucked up individual, I understand that you have been hurt very, very bad, okay? But like I said, you're cheating yourself. You are very much so cheating yourself, okay? Because, yes, I'm not saying here in 2023 it's an abundance of people who, you know what I'm saying, um, got, you know, the right things on their mind and to be able to give you what you want. But, damn it, it is somebody, okay? And, and to just continue to play these games, you're putting so much at risk, okay? You're putting your life at risk. You're putting your, um, your health at risk, okay? Um, you're hurting people. So what you're doing is you're building up karma for yourself. You see what I'm saying? So please, if this is you, you know, start thinking, you know what I'm saying? And learn how to forgive. You see what I'm saying? Because honestly, this comes from this root is because somebody has hurt somebody very, very bad that they have not forgiven. It's just as simple. And they're more bitter and more worse than the person that actually hurt them. Okay. So um, if you're dealing with this person, get yourself checked out for STD. Um, lick your wounds, keep on stepping, understand that this is the type of person that you're dealing with. And, um, you know, I don't see them changing any, any, any time, you know what I'm saying? Pray for them. Okay. The Lord Jesus is able to change any and everybody pray for them. Okay. So this is what I have for you. Let me go ahead and tell you this queen of wands right here, this Leo Sagittarius Aries is somebody is so very sprung off of right now and who will be a uh, ex situation here pretty soon. This is a fun girl right here. Gemini. Yeah, doing all this damn lying. Cancer. Virgo towards Capricorn. Virgo. Yeah, constantly having somebody blinded to the truth. Acting as if they love somebody. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Acting as if they are going to be in this person. This person just gets missing in action, okay? Gemini. person travels back and forth Aquarius is here person falls back they got clarity that they fall back they're in constant full energy when it comes down to other people they made a judgment shot. Anytime somebody gets close, they make a judgment shot, okay? This is what I have for you guys. If I was able to put one piece together for you, then I have definitely done my job. I would appreciate it if you guys like, share, and subscribe. And I love you guys so much.